Hi, I'm C. Solaris here, author of Calypso's Hard, Orion's Order, book one, and I am here in the About the Author Q&A video series to share a question that was asked to me by a reader recently. So I was asked, do you have a notebook or something where you write all your ideas or does it just come to you when you start writing? So forewarning, I didn't write down my answer and I'm kind of just going off the fly here. So if I go off on tangents or stumble or whatnot, <laughs> you'll know why, <laughs> but you'll get a little bit of an insight as to who I am that way, I think. All right, so do you have a notebook or something where you write all of your ideas? Yes, I have a few Google Docs and I use Google. I have a few Google Docs that I use and one of them is this massive document that I call the Species World Bible. <laughs> and it's actually the document that I started writing in since day one, that very first day that I woke up, I saw the Species World and the characters in my head and I started writing it down. And it has, of course, since then grown massive amounts <laughs> since then. And so I have the Species World Bible and it's all about world building and a ton of great things that I don't want to give any spoilers for, <laughs> but I have that one document. And then I have another document that I use and it's for, future things in the pipeline. Again, I don't want to give any spoilers, <laughs> but it's another document for future stories that I've seen, ideas, scenes, characters, all the things that, um, yeah, anyway, so it goes in this document. And then I have a third document, very similar, but it's categorized differently. Again, I'm not going to uh, give away any spoilers, but there you go. So I have like three massive documents. The big one is the Species World Bible. And then the second part of this question was, does it come to you when you just start writing? So yes, I do see scenes in my head and it plays out like a movie in my head and then I just start writing it down. And sometimes I'll see things, like when I was writing book one, I was already seeing things for book two, three, four, five, <laughs> tons of things in the future. And so I, I get these glimpses, these flashes, I guess sometimes I kind of feel like a seer a little bit. And so I get these glimpses and these flashes of scenes or characters or things and I don't really know what they mean yet, but I know like it'll play out and I'll understand what it means later when I get to that part of the story. But um, when that happens, I will stop what I'm doing and I'll write that down so I don't forget it. And so that goes in this massive, um, one of the massive documents I was talking about. And let me see if I got that. Does it come to you when you start writing? Yeah, so when I was when I start writing, it often flows in chronological order, but sometimes I will get glimpses in the future and then I'll write it down and then I'll have to go back to the story. And so it gets a little confusing and crazy in my head, which is why I started that document, which is now the document is a little confusing and crazy, but it works for me. And so I don't think anyone who would see it, it would make no sense to them, but for me it works. And right now that works for me. So I hope that answers your question. And if anyone has any other questions, then feel free to reach out to me and let me know in the comments or a message or however, and I will get to it in a future video. All right, so that's it for today's video and I will see you in the next video. Bye.